Yo guys, Fib here, and today I come to you with a fully, with incitation marks, functional x-ray machine. <laughs> uh, I am right now in 14W06B, which is the latest snapshot uh, as I am speaking. Although by the time this video comes out, there might be an 07 already. Um, and I have found a way to make a functioning x-ray machine, essentially. Uh, let me just get straight into it and show you how it works. Uh, let's see, we need to block that off. Oh, not meat, but there. There we go. And as you can see, I have a one piece of TNT and I press and bam, nothing. But then I do that and now I see everything. Okay, so right now I'm actually flying. Uh, so this, of course, would mean that it only works in uh, creative, but it also works in in a um, in a little bit more irritating way. It also works in um, survival. Essentially, all you have to do is, and this is why I have the regeneration because you are going to take suffocation damage. All you have to do is, let's see, slash game mode zero. And when you do this, uh, let me just take one of these as well, <laughs> just in case. Because like I said, you're going to take re regeneration damage. So it is a good idea to have some uh, regen going. And then you do this and you can jump and look. And it's a bit annoying, I know, but you can see around a little bit. As you can see, there's some stuff down there. Interesting, interesting. There might be a some there. Oh, I'm almost dying, so I just hit that. This is why I'm using TNT, because... Uh, the TNT block uh, breaks uh, very easily. Just one hit and it breaks. You can also do this with glowstone or sponges or whatever, although I don't think you can actually get sponges right now, but still. Uh, so, yeah, any of those blocks. I think you can do it with basically almost any block that has um, that has some kind of uh, transparency thing going although well no let's actually let's try that let's try with this one let's see if that works yeah okay so it works with any block except for transparent blocks I mean any fully opaque blocks works uh, unfortunately I slime blocks do not work I was hoping they would work better Oi, that didn't I didn't mean to do that you have to oh, <laughs> you have to have a block here, otherwise you have to jump into a block. That's one of the things you have to do. You also have to have this block here open. If you, for instance, do this. Uh, and step, oh, come on, jump down. Stand here and do this. Then when you're flying, all you see is TNT. Because then suddenly you start seeing this one. You have to have... This block has to be open. So, yeah. But other than that, uh, eh, it works. Kinda, sorta. <laughs> and uh, that's the only difference between this one, this, uh, this machine and uh, the regular ones, is you need to have one block open down here. Uh, so, yeah, this, as you can see, it's not very efficient. I mean, you can only... Uh, let's see, let's put that in again and do this. You can only, it's only a 90 degree view, or a little bit more than 90 degrees, but still. Um, I guess if you are proficient enough, and if, if you want to play around a little bit with the redstone, you might be able to get so you can see this side as well. You won't be able to see the floor, unfortunately. And look at that, there we have a spawner, yay. Uh, but yeah, I guess this is this is mostly just a proof of concept. That's that's what I usually do. I put out proof of concepts and I let the smart guys do the rest. <laughs> so as you might know if you see my other videos. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. If you find a way to make this more efficient, or if you yeah, if you find a way to do this without actually taking damage or having to jump like a crazy person, then feel free to comment. Otherwise, just comment as well. Like and subscribe if you want to. 
Uh, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye!